So, Corey, we, uh, why don't you tell me where you've been lately? Well, I've been to Donald Trump's. I've been to... It's about all the places that I've been, but I got a letter from the King and Queen of England. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Fred, where have you been lately? Uh, I, I saw the Lost World Jurassic Park movie. I've been taking it easy since the movie premiere. You know, lay low, be quiet, and, you know, and enjoying my life. Yeah, enjoying your life? Yeah. So has uh, has the, the movie affected you at all? Yeah, no, I mean, for the couple of weeks, I'm the same old guy, you know, you know and love. Yeah? Yeah. Now, why don't you tell Croy uh, about your part? Oh, my part? Yeah. Uh, well, no. Well, I was in the movie. I was cut from the movie, so, you know, so, um, I, I just did like an introduction when how it goes to Hartford. That, that, that right bastard cracker Bob took my part away from me, but it's okay in my book. Corey, why don't you show me this outfit that you have on today? Did you wear this special for Howard? Yes, I did. And plus that, when I got here, Tommy Lee was here. And... I was thinking about all of garments, all of the garments that Pamela Lee wore to court, and I approved of every one of them. <laughs> <laughs> so why don't you tell me what, what's what is that like hanging out in the middle of your chest there? This is my letter from the King and Queen of England, my letter from Mr. Bella Lugosi Jr., and my letter from the White House that I've received, in, pertinent to the issue of my. Um, architecture that Ronald Reagan took away from me. All right, Croy, so just hang tight. All right, good morning and goodbye. <laughs> okay. And wish me luck. I wish you luck. Good Thank luck. you. Okay. Thank you. With us today is Fred the Elephant Boy. How you doing, Howard? And, of course, Croy. I thought there was someone here I sort of recognized. How do you describe Croy and what she does? I don't know what she you does. You don't know yet because I'm not into manifestation. Right, that's what she right. does. She just says stuff that you don't even know what she's talking about. Fred the Elephant Boy, what have you been up to uh, quickly? Uh, n nothing much since the movie came out. I'm taking it easy. Uh, oh, you're keeping a low profile, yeah. overexposed while the movie was out? Yeah, well, not overexposed. Were you in the movie? I know. People said they saw me in the movie. Right. They said, if you see me, you got great eyes. Right. Yeah, but anyway, you've been keeping a low profile. Yeah. Croy, what have you been up to uh, real quick? Go ahead, tell us. I've been waiting for Donald Trump to pick me up. For what? To make a personal announcement to Mr. Clinton and a return reply to the King and Queen of England about my architecture that was taken. Right. Uh, Roy uh, says that the President of the United States, Bill Clinton, stole her architecture. No, no, Ro Ronald Reagan. I mean, Ronald Reagan yeah. stole... Right, right, stole her architecture. It's nuclear incineration for Fidel Castro, Strategico Armistitenti Corporation Cuba, and it's a nightclub for Muhammad Ali, and it's not... Uh, <laughs> Massive population nightclub. It's a closed reserve nightclub. By the way, just in case anyone's wondering, this woman has something stuffed in her cleavage. I don't know what cardboard. It's, it's the letters that I got from Mr. Bella Lugosi Jr. Oh. And um, the King and Queen of England, and from the White House also. And that for, they they announced. Any from Frank Gifford in there? <laughs> Croy, you always have a message of inspiration for my audience, something that's on your mind. Would you like to tell them anything? Go ahead. The microphone is if yours. If anybody sees Dennis Rodman, will they please send him to me via Howard Stern? Why? Why? Are you in love with him? No, but I'm in a lot of trouble, and I'd like him to overlook my situation. And what me. is the trouble, please? So that it's Dennis my Rod rental. Your rental? Uh, yeah. And what Dennis is going Rodman on? knows rental? I'm, no, but I'd like to ask him for financial assistance. Oh, I see. What is going on with your rental? Without intimacy. Aha. Uh -huh. Now, let me so understand I something. he does have some mentality. Talk into this microphone. You believe he has mentality? Yeah. Okay, listen to me. You are saying that your rent, you're having trouble uh, yeah. coming up with your rent. Yeah. And you, but you want Dennis Robbins' help, but you do not want to put out for him sexually. Right. Right. Now, she's got a mink thing on, and, uh, you know, yeah. you're all dressed up today. Just Why don't you not spend money on clothes and pay your rent? Well, how would you like me to walk in in my uh, Levi's and my boots? That's fine. <laughs> pay your rent. <laughs>
Yeah. See, Robin just solved your problem. <laughs> yes, Robin would solve my problem. <laughs> Incidentally, Robin, I, I bought myself a pair of chaps. Do you know what they are? Yes, of course I do. I yeah. love mine. Good yeah. for you. I have a pair, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I wear them every day. No, I don't. <laughs> I'd like to see you. too personal with you? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'd like to see you in those chaps. Thank yeah. you. Maybe no, next time I'll wear them. Mm. And also, um, Coochie Coochie. Yes. Me mucho. I would like to say buenos dias. All right, all right, all right. All right, listen, i got to take a break. <laughs> all right, it was nice to have spoken with everyone yeah. this morning. For the Elephant Boy, is it true that you hate Crackhead Bob? No. Are you jealous of all the appearances? No, you guys I'm make happy. him thousands every month. Yeah, I'm happy for him. Are oh, you available I, for appearances? Yeah, but, yeah, but I, you know, I have my 15 minutes of fame. Sooner or later, things will die down. And there would be a new kid on the block, so I oh, always, oh, oh. I always oh. get. Do you feel like you've been replaced by Crackhead Bob? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah. must. Uh, yeah, Howard. yeah, but I don't mind. Really? Yeah, Why no, do you I'm feel not, that way? Croy, have oh. a seat. We're not done. Yeah, Croy, just sit yeah. down and listen. No, because because I think Crackhead is the new kid on the block. I'm like. I've been on the show for eight years now. You're yesterday's news. Yeah. Uh-huh. So I'm happy for him, so I always get with him. Why do you think the listener's uh, fancy has been captured by Bob? Because he's new. It's a right of new guy. Be- but believe me, when I first, after I first came out to show, people was crazy about me. But you never, <laughs> you, afraid, you never got like eight appearances at a grand. Yeah, well, yeah, but be, but you never made the big money. Yeah, you know, you remind me of the black but, guy who says the Beatles made all the money. No. But the old uh, best out. I never mind. I never mind because I always had like a record shop. I don't need to make cakes to make money. I, see. I have a record shop. So right. if I took a cake, I have a so But you are I available think. for regular jobs, yeah. like uh, for appearances like a uh, yeah. crackhead bar. Yes, uh, yeah. But I am not a uh, county talent. You're bitter actor. like Mickey Mantle. You know, he oh. used to sit there. Why do all oh. these guys get this so much money? I they never got the money. In all honesty, I'm sorry, what? Did you see Mr. George Steinbrenner brought in uh, Japanese and he also bought in Cincinnati two yes. men. I didn't know that. Nice. Mm, thank you. <laughs> that um, bracelet that's on your arm, Howard? That's not a bracelet. It's a hair tie. Oh, huh. I was going to ask you if it was like a, a lay. It looks like a lay from over here. Somehow I'm not thinking about getting laid right now. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, you know, the you thing know, that I, uh, right. I noticed about... Uh, Croy? Yeah. No. Elephant, Elephant Boy Boy's yeah. uh, diatribe there. Yes. Was that, was that a <laughs> Yes. Was that he's saying, I just can't wait for uh, Crackhead Bob to be replaced now. Oh. <laughs> ah. he's, he's Is saying, that right? You know, he said in the green room that, uh, that Rat Bastard and Crackhead I, Bob stole my scene from the movie. I because they both introduced Hartford, but I Bob know. made it to the movie and, and Fred did. I was, I was speaking from the camera. That's how you get to one. So I was, it was me being... You got aced out of the movie Danny. by Crackhead Bob. Yeah, so I, I, I'm happy for him. So, so without any said to God, I offer my congratulations to Cracker Bob. It's a good guy. We are well, good friends, go. and I nothing, no, no contempt for him. All I'm right. always happy for him. Spoke like a true gentleman. But that's how you get around with him. Right? Yes. Howard, yes. Did you see Mike Tyson's home on television? Yes, I did. Is your home quite that beautiful? No, it is not. Thank you. All right. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. It's very nice. You're welcome. She's pulling things out of her chest. <laughs> no, I've been keeping time to get here. I just got oh, the message. Well, thank you very much, Croy. Okay. Croy, everybody, who is uh, so uh, thoughtful and always has so many dynamic things to say. Fred the Elephant Boy who has dynamic things to say, but no one can ever understand oh, them. Yeah. And uh, uh, congratulations to you. Oh, yeah. uh, can I say one thing? Uh, ha- ha- hello to Tom and Marty and to anybody who knows me who, who I promise I will message their name. What? The list is too long, so I've got to say Hi to everybody I know. Said well, said well. <laughs> Howard? Yes? If, if you can hold on a second, there's a guy on the phone who um, had sex with Elephant Boy. What? You're kidding me. God. What's going on with that? You still, uh... You still gay? You still gay or <laughs> what? When did you have... You had more gay sex? Let me listen to him. Who, who's the guy? <laughs> oh, Fred. You want to punch you guys? What? Do not spit into the microphone. I was just spitting. He's, he's not oh spitting into the microphone. It's all right, Croy. He's, he's fine. Spit. He's not spitting into the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> What's this about? You back to doing that again, or what? No, I'm not popping before. I, I'm. I, I, you go, I you're still swinging both ways. Uh, not, not anymore. But you have had sex with a guy. Yeah. No. 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 Oh, when did you Fred. try it? When did you try it? Uh, a little after the last time I was here. Oh really? Fred. Oh, Fred. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Fred, you told us. 
because you didn't do that. Should we hit? The, should we talk to this guy or what? You want yes, to know? of course. I will see you turn up. You don't want to? Because I'll be honest with you. What? I will, I will be honest with you. Uh, I will be honest with you. There's no need to speak with that jerk. Really? He was what, a jerk? Wait a minute. You, yeah, you I don't slept know who with he is. a jerk? I mean, not, <laughs> not you didn't know who he was and you slept with him? I, no, no I'm, I talked to What did you do? Somebody. I don't want to I don't want to get into it. It's, wait a minute. It's hold it. No. Stop. I can't. I tell stop. You, did I, he get I, you I pregnant? Oh, stop. Wow. No. Just stop rattling there no. for a second. All right. I'm trying to hear what he's saying. Just no, I want to ask a question. Go ahead. So that ad that we have you doing for the phone was real. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I think I was, I'm looking for a couple in the 40s or 40s. <laughs> oh, <you're there. laughs> it was the male is spy. Okay, have your laugh. All right, okay, who cares? <laughs> so yeah, now, it? wait a minute. Who's this? Fred, where are you down, going? Fred. Sit down. Don't get all embarrassed. Big deal. Sit down. I'm trying to get my life back to normal. I don't need this crap to do it. All right, sit down. Sit down. All right. What is he talking about? Your life is never going to be normal. Your life is never getting back to normal. I know. If I go out I think this would be my last bit of cracker pop. You walk and be here anytime you want. Oh, no. Why are you punishing us? Yeah, what did we do? What did we do wrong? Oh, nothing much. Except, except you, except, except you, you may at me. I think that's not enough. How did we do it? We didn't do that. We You got it yourself. Yeah, that's true. So, you're, <laughs> yeah, and you're you're just, and you just exploding it. No, we're not. We're not. Oh, no. I'm asking you about it. I didn't okay. know you were into this okay. stuff. Okay. Well, I, um, um, I, uh, I do, uh, I, I do go, you know, to a uh, uh, both way when I am lonely. All right. When you're lonely, oh. go both ways. All right. Oh, if he has a woman, he won't do a guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Elephant boy. Like we can't talk to this guy? It sounds like no, what? What is that, Croy? It sounds what? Like he's cheap. Why doesn't he go buy a girl that doesn't have anything? I don't what do you say? Wait, what are you oh saying? Saying to the microphone? <laughs> How could you have a problem with Elfin Boy? He's just he's just uh, expressing his sexuality. What? I know. I was finishing him from far away. <laughs> what it you? Sound, can you hear me? Yes. yes. It sounds to me like you're very cheap because there are so many girls that would like to have twenty dollars to buy themselves a bar of soap or a pair of underpants or a pair of shoes. And if that's the <laughs> way that you get off so easy, why I don't th- you go track down RuPaul and wear the new dress that he bought? Of course, mm. RuPaul. Well, yeah. you don't like you don't like guys who go with men. Are you anti-gay? Yeah. No, their sala- their saliva is yeah. putrid and their perspiration is putrid. Really? Yeah. Wow, you're really anti-gay, aren't you? No, not necessarily. Mm-hmm. No, I'm, I'm, I'm that's not my term. Anyway. Well, often, boy, out of respect to you, if you don't want to talk to this guy, gaiety I won't. Gaiety is gaiety, no, right? Don't. You want to pass on this guy? Yes, sir. Oh, well, then you talk that's to us. That's right. You should be ashamed. Yeah. Uh-huh. What happened? How'd this uh, happen? What are you, religious or something, Croy? Is that what it is? Mm-mm. Hmm. I'm just immaculate. You are immaculate. You better believe it. Mm-hmm. I thought so. Uh, and how did Elephant Boy hook up with this guy? Through. Yeah, how'd you meet some guy? Uh, th- th- After th- the show? Line. Th- through the line. Through the line, yeah. yeah. And the guy turned out to be a jerk? Uh, if of course he saw, uh, I don't think he knows me. It could be somebody who make up a story. I have no idea. I don't want to speak to anybody regards to this. So really, it was a bad experience. Know. Yeah, well, I, 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 it was, it was bad, but I don't know who the guy is. It could be true. This could be a, a BS artist. I don't know. And I don't but, care. Oh, I see. So yeah, one right. way or the other, I don't care. One way. Okay, or calm the down. Other. We're not speaking to him. All right, man, take it easy. Like him. Calm yeah. down, dude. Well, so you got. <laughs> Got a call from somebody through this line. Yeah, yeah. This guy, whoever you were with, left a bad taste in your mouth? No. Oh. I don't know who, who this guy is. <laughs> don't it distract was, him was, with the guy on the phone. Me, yeah. it, Forget the guy on I the know. phone. I'm my, saying the... My experience has been, you know, blessed by... Are you back to been, women now, or yeah. are you for good? Uh, uh, no. Okay, so, uh, you know me better than me, Rob. I think I do. You're saying you're going back to women in total? No, I, let me tell you some, uh, something, you know, and I don't want to go to too much detail uh, uh, for the last almost two two months I have uh, seen uh, ma- a ma- or talked to Mary my girl from uh, Cleveland that because doing the best to my she being very very ill you know mm-hmm. and I need some you know you need some release your girlfriend release, was, it wasn't it was available to you sexually to, uh, yeah so you you went to a man and uh, and you yeah. it didn't work out so good Hey, right. It was a, it was a, it was a nice, a, 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 a experience, but it was only an experience. Mm. You know. <laughs> so, Thank you. So, do you go out on a date, or do no. you just meet and, just and, me. and do your thing? Just me. So you met him, and then you, did you go Where'd somewhere you with him? No. Oh, you never had sex? 
Oh, uh, no. Yeah. Really? What? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, admit, no, uh, did then I, no. Uh, admit, During dinner, you didn't have sex? Uh, no. <laughs> right. I mean, no, uh, I don't want to get into it. Uh, no, no, it was just like just a meeting. A meeting? Yeah. Where? At the, go- at the guy's house. Oh. <laughs> and you had dinner together? No. Hey, no you had a little, little sex? That is no yeah. meeting. So was yeah. he attractive to you? No. Nah. No? Yeah. Did he tie you up? And yeah. No, not for that. Take, take your ATM card? No. <laughs> no, it was not for that. Right. So how do you set up a situation like that? You talk to the guy on the yeah. phone? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. It, it seems like sincere, but uh, who... It seems sincere, but, uh, you know... Well, you know, as a celebrity, that. you have to be careful. I know. I have. To, I, uh, you know, you're a celebrity now. You yeah. got to be careful. That's you're looking it. to get in videotape. You like Frank Gifford. Uh, yeah. Takes, um, you Wait better a call. Wait, hold on. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> what is it, Gary? You know, it's funny. I mean, and Fred, you know, I like you and stuff. And I I'm know, never, we never goofed. Goof no, no, show. and we never goofed on the way you talk. But yeah. I'd love to meet the guy who just only heard him, didn't see him, mm, right. and decided he have to have, had had sex with him. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sure he knew him from the show. That's right. It was a celebrity thing. Right. Enough. So what happened? You were with the guy sexually, and you didn't like it. I, not that I didn't like it. Or like it. It was an experience. Right. It was. It was okay. I, I'm not banging my head against the wall. You How's know, regret it. Oh. Nothing like that. What? No, Nothing like that. No. no. <laughs> did you do anything? <laughs> not really. Who did what? M- mostly him. Mostly. <laughs> he mostly did it. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> mostly him. <laughs> mostly. What is it, Croy? Yeah. In the film, in the last. Scene, you met a girl with two children and a baby in her arms. That was his that wife. was my wife. Is that little baby the real true little baby of yours? No. Does your real true little baby have black hair, raven uh, black uh, hair? No. no, not 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 pitch black hair like that. No. Oh, that baby was beautiful. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. I had nothing to do with that. Right. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't. Not whatsoever. No. <laughs> Thank you. Well, it's not my kid. Yeah, go ahead. You know what I don't understand? Like Fred, you've tried this yeah. a couple of times, right? Yeah. Several times, and. If you if you tried it once and you knew you didn't like it, you wouldn't do it. It's so if you, if you don't mind it, it's want, not, there's nothing wrong with. I don't with want to say. I don't want to say. I, I didn't like it. It, uh, it like caught a bit. That's it. I'm It was. It, it wasn't that bad. Mostly, right, the, whether that I didn't like it, it wasn't that bad. So. But there's I nothing think, to be ashamed of if you do. Not, I'm being honest. I think you might be gay. No. Yeah. Okay, let, let, let that. I think I I think I think I you know I talked to my co- uh, you know I co- you know coffee and said I like, ex- uh, 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 you know uh, uh, except that I I did I did with guy and I promise her and and she's much more important than any guys you know I'll be happy to meet and I promise her I'll be like a one woman guy. Right. Oh, so you can be with guys? No, <laughs> no, no. He's saying no. he promises his girlfriend he's gonna just be with her. That girl that used to sex with animals ever come back here? <laughs> Oh, Lord, Croy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, buddy. we got one uh, wacky <laughs> conversation going. Yeah, right. yeah. Well, anyway, listen, Elephant Boy, good oh, luck with you. Okay, thank you, Howard. I know you're, I know you're busy uh, with men and women and confused, but <laughs> yeah, if, any, if we could be any help to you. my bookings now. <laughs> there is wait a, a minute, wait a minute. You know, because your, book, your bookings just thing, went up. Yeah. The one thing that I find fascinating about this yeah. is that he lied to us and he told us that phone message was a joke. Yeah, what? Well, he was having I a hard time. To protect my son. He was having a hard time. And second, when his girlfriend was here with him at some point yeah. he said he was never going to be with another man uh, and then well, right then after that he left after him was with a man he was weak what? he was no. weak <laughs> no, I t- I you don't know what, Robin, you are prettier today than you were in those yesterday <laughs> photographs thank you very <laughs> much <laughs> <laughs> well get it back to me this is what uh, it must be like to be in a mental institution <laughs> You know what I mean? Like everybody just yeah. talking. Everybody I doing non sequiturs. Yes, yes. non sequiturs. Yes. Swish. <laughs> there comes Tarzan. <laughs> <laughs> All right, listen, Elephant Boy. Yeah. I understand what happened with you. You mm. slipped. You know what? It's like a guy, yeah. an alcoholic you who slipped. slips. It don't matter yeah. what sexuality is. Um, as well, long as you keep well, telling us. Well, I love you anyway. You know? I know you do. I don't know why you don't want to talk to this guy on the phone, what you're uh, afraid of, but there's probably something good there. I never knew you to be afraid. I never knew you to be afraid. Because, no, I don't want to make this my profit laugh and why do you to <gasps> you drag your puppy. girlfriend out for us yeah. to see. Yeah. Why don't you drag your boyfriend out? Yeah. Howard, can yeah. I ask you something, Howard? Yeah. Do you think he doesn't want to talk to him because maybe he did acts that he's not admitting mm, to? Maybe. I don't know. I never saw Elephant Fred, Boy just shook up. Because he's yeah. making it like he's just a... I never saw you this afraid. It's not like talk a f- to the guy. A f- uh, yeah. He's telling it, it like he was totally passive. Yeah. Mm. It may not even be the guy. I may not be not totally passive. Should we check and see if it's really the guy? Okay. All right. Good enough. All right. Let's go. All right. Who loves you, baby? Hello? Who loves yeah. you, baby? One second. Hello? Uh, first of all, to what's her name? Corey? Croy. 
Uh, she's anti-gay. I'm anti-stupid, honey. So we're in the same department. <laughs> What's oh, your never name? mind. But don't get caught. What's up your that. name? Don't give up. What's your first name? I'm not yeah. giving out my name. But Fred then. knows exactly who I am. We won 54th and third, and we did it. 54th and where? Third at my accountant building, and we did it. That is a lie. It's a lie. It is a lie. I'm yeah, a lie. I, I, I was never. Oh, yeah, I don't hang out in New proof. York. Who, who are you? You, you, you a hole? I almost said the wrong word. I have proof, Howard. I have proof because I. I was never 54 at Third Avenue. No. I know. I don't know where. I don't if they have. Are there any distinguishing marks on his genitalia? <laughs> yes, yes, and I know something else. What? At the point of elation. <laughs> yeah. okay. That's right. Number one, he doesn't even cleanse himself. He smelled. Yeah, who are you, you oh, that's true. B- BS artist? <laughs> <laughs> who are you, you BS artist? This guy's obviously making a story. I, Howard, I will prove myself right now at the point of elation. Yeah, At the point of elation, the elephant boy lays back and he screams out. Yeah, right. Gary, you're a horse tooth jacket. <laughs> 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 Okay, that was good. <laughs> God, All right. so Elephant boy, you I see, you, you were afraid. You yeah, were afraid. I was afraid. You were afraid, God, and you shouldn't have been. How did this guy know Elephant boy had been with a man? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, listen. Who cares? <laughs> we got to move on to the press conference. We're late, Robin. We have a lot of show to get to. Croy, thank you for coming in. Love you, baby. Uh, you do, Croy, and uh, you look beautiful today. Stunning in your new outfit. And is that a? Oh, I see. It's a watch. I think you're popping out of your top. Elephant boy, I don't care if you're with men or women. It's always good to see you. The boss, you know why I happy I do. I was, I was, the guy was yesterday. You always treat me fair and always, okay. Always. So I, I will never have any bad words to say about you. Thank I don't care whether you put me. You're the not movie. resigning from the show, are you? No, but All I right. could take it easy. I mean, I'm not going to always go up carry after my make. You know, Elephant Boy is always pocket. available for appearances. Okay. Thank you, Elephant Can Boy. Can take me go, go, go up carry and hear it for you? The cards. Got to cut him off somewhere. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what did he say, Robin? <laughs> call Gary and he'll forward the call. Good. All right. Elephant Boy available. Bye-bye. Thank you. Hi, Croy. Thank you for the lovely visit. Yeah, did you have fun? Absolutely. And do you think uh, this appearance might help you get your architecture back? It was the best plugs I ever put in in my life. Yeah? Yeah. Now, Every you, one of them is beneficial to my future. Now, do you not like Fred, the guy that was in there? Oh, well, I'm not familiar with him at all. I mean, uh, I, mean I would tip him, but I, w- I would never um, socialize. You would never socialize? No. What do you mean you would tip him? I would tip him. What do you mean tip him? Pay his cab fare. Oh. Give him a dollar. But but you don't necessarily you don't necessarily want to like hang out with him. No, now I would never make a com- he, a camaraderie with him. Now that he admitted, you know, that he had some gay relations. Yeah. You know. Uh, well, that's, that's all right because like, RuPaul just bought uh, Princess Diana's dress, so they're just. Um, Every every which way you look, every way everyone's lacking ethics. So what the heck? But you're not against gay people. Yes, I am. You are. Yes, I am. So then you don't like you wouldn't like Frank. No, I wouldn't. Because because he admitted that he has done right. some gay stuff. But it's a hot revenue. But it's a hot revenue. Yeah. Oh, I'm, a, I'm a hot what? You're a hot revenue because you're what? gay and she doesn't like gay people. No. Well, I don't think I'm, I, I care. I should like who I'm in. I, I don't care what, 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 whatever anybody thinks of me. I know who my true friends true friends are. And I, I will really care what they say one way or the other. Do you still have a lot of true friends now? That yeah. Yeah. Stuff things, things, things have changed gen- gen- one way or the other. I don't. I don't I thought to look over the years, Safi, I have my fair wealth of friends. I know who my true friends are. 